participate in the Latakian Seminar, an intensive four-day program focused on Jewish values and social justice, sponsored by the Religious Action Center, which is the legislative office of the Union of Reform Judaism, whose 900 congregations across North America encompass 1.5 million Reform Jews, and the Central Conference of American Rabbis, whose membership includes over 2,000 members. We would like to discuss three different issues with you today. They are gun control, reproductive rights, and climate change and energy. Gun control is clearly an important issue based on the recent events in the United States. So many lives are put at risk when these weapons fall into the wrong hands. Lives are lost, people get very seriously injured, and families can be broken by a pull of a trigger. Each year in America, 30,000 people die from gun violence, and each day, eight Americans under the age of 19 die due to gun violence. A limit is needed somewhere in these dangerous weapons. We go about our daily lives not thinking they could be dangerous, but we are proven wrong by recent, recent shootings, such as Sandy Hook Elementary School shooting in Newtown, Connecticut, and the movie theater shooting in Aurora, Colorado. In Newtown, the shooter was using a Bushmaster Master .223 semi-automatic rifle carrying many bullets, which is considered an assault weapon. Guns are very easy to purchase at gun shows, and background checks are easily bypassed. In order to keep America safer and prevent shootings, we need to work towards the Fixed Gun Checks Act to become approved. This will increase a safer environment within our country, protect our people, and prevent deaths by improving the background check system to keep guns out of the hands of dangerous people. Something else that would be worth reintroducing would be the assault weapon ban. It is understood that handguns are often used for protection within households, but there is no reason for a citizen to be carrying an assault weapon, such as a rifle or a machine gun. On February 27, 2012, three students at Chardon High School in Chardon, Ohio, were shot and killed by a gunman. This was my cousin's school at the time. A love family friend was one of the victims killed. His death brought sadness and fear to family, friends, and students all over America. Gun use should be controlled because students should not question their safety at school. The fact that 53% of all murders in the United States are committed with handguns forces us to focus our attention and concern on this dangerous, concealable, and accessible weapon. Gun violence prevention measures can save thousands of lives and can help to prevent tragedies like the murder of my cousin's friend. This issue is important to us as Jews because in the true Jewish tradition, we emphasize the sanctity and value of human life. The dehumanizing of the human being and the carelessness with which human life is taken by guns stands in direct violation of the Talmud, which states, he who takes one life, it is though he has destroyed the universe, and he who has saved one life, it is though he has saved the universe. Scripture encourages us, encourages peaceful pursuit of our mutual welfare, and those who use guns are in indirect conflict with the affirmations of our tradition. Thank you for your support and sharing our values and views towards prevention of gun violence. We hope that you continue to prioritize the passage of the Fixed Gun Checks Act and Assault Weapon Ban in the coming Congress.